The engineering season really sits at the heart of the v &A's mission of returning to its founding identity of being a museum that marries a showcase of art, design and sciences. We were involved very early on in the discussions about the history of the firm and some of the key projects that we actually had some archive material that could help uh, tell the story. Things like those drawings of the Sydney Opera yes. House and, and in fact they restored some of the materials we had for the exhibition. To be able to open up these boxes, many of which haven't seen the light of day for decades, you don't quite know what you're going to find. Any starting point with that always has to be the Sydney Opera House, but also the Kingsgate Footbridge, which was uh, Overlap's favourite project. And earlier projects as well, like the penguin pool at the London Zoo, yes. and work that he did during the war on bomb shelters. These plans actually never saw the light of day. A couple of years ago, we became aware of a model in the basement of the Sydney Opera House Trust of the erection arch. I thought, well, if this model could be shown anywhere, it could be the V&A. They knew that it was in pieces, and so the initial question was, is it even feasible? Should and could we you know, bring it back to life, stand it up to its sort of former glory? One particular photograph we were looking at was this stress testing model of the uh, Sydney Opera House. And somehow that image became quite a leading image to design the structure so that it really feels like a laboratory. Because it's a grade one listed building, we in essence have had to build a black box gallery space that floats inside the original fabric of the building. It's, it's a lot of fun, but it of course involves a lot of structural engineers. The Porter Gallery main space is going to include a, a mezzanine frame um, on which people will be walking. When you have people walking above on this lightweight frame and then you've got objects on display on this lightweight frame, you don't want the people standing on the floor to notice a movement in those objects. We're reviewing the, the loads that that frame puts on the existing floor. We're also assessing the other object weights that sit directly on the floor and are hung from the ceiling. Engineering tends to be a discussion focused on science museums, not design museums, and we're really, really keen to talk about it from the perspective of creativity and the stories of creative designers. So do a V&A take on engineering. I'm a graduate and I've been working in Arab for 18 months now. I really think Arab is amazing, but it kind of shows everyone how great Arab is.